<laughs> okay, everybody. Here we go. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, our next political act comes from a strange and unusual place. He hopes to uh, finish this performance before the place realizes that he's escaped. <laughs> so please welcome Rockin' Abe. Well, I'd rather rock and roll than to be president. Oh, yes, I'd rather rock and roll than to be president. Yeah, that's the way the big money gets spent. Oh, I'd rather rock and roll. Yeah, I'd rather sing than to speak to a crowd. You know that I'd rather sing than to speak to a crowd. So sing along now, sing the song loud. Yeah, I'd rather. Rocket Abe. Good, you know, good to be here. You know what we were just thinking? Back when you were around, if they would have had cable, you would have been able to see the movie there. You wouldn't have had to go to that theater. You'd probably be alive today. Probably. It's an amazing story. Richard Klein, let's get a score for Rocket Abe. They called Abe Lincoln the rail splitter. <laughs> this guy was a head splitter. <laughs> I gave him a seven. Pretty good. Pretty good, hey, Abe. Great. Yeah. That's an honest score, too, by the way. Karen Haber. Oh. I give you an eight. Okay. Great, great. We'll take the he eight. Was cute. Haywood G oh, Banks. He was that was an emancipating uh, little review you did, Darren. I gave him a six. I really. I, I'm Thank feeling you. a six that's not right bad, now. Yeah, for a dead president. Okay, when we total it up, it's a 21, and that's pretty good. Old honest Dave. Thank you for being here, buddy. Bye bye. Follow me, boys. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs>